president Sean prayers called by Governor Soludo to avert evil of Sita too. <laughs> oh my God. This is really very, very laughable. What are they praying for? When they know what to do. The Saudis leaders should go and ask the president, Muhammad Buhari, to release Marzi in Namdekano. And the story of C. Tartone becomes an history. That is just what these people are talking about. The truth is that this agitation has left Marzi in Namdekano. That is the truth. It's now in the hands of the people. They are now the one deciding what to do. Because Marzi in Namdekano, IPOP member, the DOS, ho, 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 and all of them, they have been saying, they have been crying out, please, everybody, you know, should go to their normal businesses on Sunday, or uh, I beg your pardon, every Monday. No more sit at home. You can sit at home the only day our leaders we, we appear in court. But they say no. They don't agree. This man, when they agitate for for their freedom say they suffer for them and true true the man has gone through a lot so they said they will not stop sitting at home until their leader is being released now the new anambra state governor uh, governor soludo you know has been asking residents to commence their normal monday activities but they don't tell and say make you not put mad for this matter. I say because the matter big person. <laughs> say I pop Marta and sit at home. Big person. That the only thing he can do is for them to ask the federal government to release Mazin Nandikano. I beg, make me go see what actually happened today. Governor Chukuma Soludo of Anambra State has directed the people of the state to observe one day prayer to counter the evil effects of the Monday sit at home order. However, Sahara reporters observed that the residents of the state observed the weekly sit at home ritual as they bycourted the prayers. Soludo on Saturday ordered the prayer session, which he said will work against the activities of the gunmen terrorizing the state and the southeast region as a whole. He said, I enjoy you to pause and join in fellowship as we seek the face of God. It is expected that the conclusion of the prayer session shall mark the end of sit at home in Anambra State. But the residents avoided the prayers as the governor and the only a few other persons were cited in the church. From photos shared on social media, the governor, the government officials, and a few other persons were cited offering prayers in the almost empty church. The mass which was held at the St. Joseph Cathedral, Eklobia, Ugota Council area, started at exactly 11 a.m. and we celebrated by the Catholic Bishop of Ecolobia Diocese, Most Reverend Peter Okpalaki. Since his swearing in ceremony, the governor has been finding a lasting solution to the seat at home ritual in the state, which he said has been drawing the state and the southeast region back economically. Last week, Soludo ordered all public servants in Anambra State to always report to work on Mondays like every other weekdays. However, only a few of the workers have com complied with the government's directive as the level of, of compliance is still relatively low. The source told Sahara reporters that only a few public servants resumed at the state secretariat, Oka. According to the source, some offices were opened in the state secretariat, but the principal offices were not in their offices. <laughs> Instead of finding out what made the rest governors of the Southeast not to talk about the city at all or issue threats, you are 
there talking hmm. who is actually advising soludo on this he is under pressure okay good and acknowledgeable of you to understand it's not in your hands to stop the seat at home protest religion will always be the last resort for them to get the mind of the people do you know why ask me if you don't know the truth is that this agitation don't pass be careful these are reactions by nigerians and they keep on talking Igbos are republican in nature we don't look at your face when you go against collective decision it is too early for governor soludo to begin fight against sitato you need to relax first work out processes of releasing mazi nandikano with other serious-minded Igbos. Then you can begin to talk about cancelling Monday seat at home. With all the public cities in he made publicities he made, why now? So people now here say governor wants one go pray. Oh, or God governor fix another prayer on the A2. <laughs> oh my god. I am optimistic that this governor does not want peaceful governance governance in anambra states too much of drinking can affect thinking faculty be one solido the discipline of simeon Iqba caused all this nonsense okay let me take it again the discipline of simeon Iqba caused all this nonsense he wants to be relevant. Beer friends don't need any enforcement to make sure people are sitting at home. Mazi Namdekanu is loved by the people. The sit at home is beyond the physical, it's spiritual. So Ludo should please meet with Southeast governors to dialogue with the federal government on how to release Mazi Namdekanu from DSS course study or he be a friend okay guys we've all heard it now these are some reactions by nigerians as you can see the southeasterners they are not ready to stop the sit at home order every monday i'm dropping it here kindly share your thoughts with us below the comment section don't forget to give us thumbs up thank you very much for always having you here bye for now mm -hmm.